everybody, what's going on? Welcome back to more of Pokemon Ruby version. In the previous episode, we crossed through Route 104 and the Petalburg Gym. And we did pretty, pretty well, all things considered. The only one that died was Poochiana. Uh, we are now in Rustboro City. And from here, I actually wanted to go back and battle a couple trainers real quick because I missed one because it was the only double battle on this route. And the only reason they wouldn't battle me was because I didn't have Poochyana. And then after this, we're going to go attempt to challenge the Rustboro City Gym Leader. Her name is Roxanne, so I guess we will see how that goes. And of course, they both have Grass-type Pokemon. Get rid of someone. I don't care which one. Just one of them. Get rid of one of them. Ugh, that's not very effective. I should have used Tackle. I'm an idiot. What is wrong with me? Astonish. Ow. Don't use Absorb. Growth. That's fine. Use Growth. I don't care. Just don't use Absorb. Tackle. Bam. Yeah. Come on, Poochiana. You can do it. Poochiana, I have faith in you! Yay, Poochiana! Good job! Good job, good job, level 8. Even better. Alright, tackle, tackle. Come on, we can take out this C dot. We can do it. Gosh, C dot is just getting stronger and stronger and stronger. I'm a little worried. I'm a little worried. Not anymore, though, because it's dead. Oh no, it's not dead. It's using Harden. But then it's dead! Come on, Poochiana! Yay! Happy face. Smiley face. Alright. Mudkip grew to level 13. Unfortunately, they took a little bit of damage, so we're gonna go heal up real quick at the Pokemon Center before we go challenge Roxanne. So, let's go ahead and heal our Pokemon. Will you heal me, Nurse Joy? I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Nurse Joy. I need to be healed again. Awesome. All right. So let's go battle Roxanne. Let's see. She should be up this way. Ah, here she is. She's in this gym leader right here. In this gym leader right here. Yes, hello. How's it going? Listen, my friend, would you like to become the champion? I'm no trainer. Not me, but I can sure give you winning advice. That's settled then. We'll aim for the Pokemon Championship together. It's your job as a trainer to collect gym badges, am I right? The gym leaders aren't pushovers, and that's where I come in. I've hammered by the expert advice. She uses rock type Pokemon, so water and grass type will be super duper effective. So, what we're gonna do is to save ourselves time, even though training Poochiana is very important. We're just gonna put Mudkip at the top so that way we can blow through this gym real quick. Don't take us gym trainers lightly. I'll show you why we're better. I bet. I bet you'll show me why you're better. For some reason, I don't believe you, but whatever! Geodude! Geodude, Geodude, it's a Geodude! Guess what? I have Water Gun. Water Gun! Woohoo! Goodbye, Mudkip! I mean, goodbye, Geodude! I, I keep calling things my Pokemon, and I don't know why. Ugh, I have no idea. I'm just not paying that much attention, I'm just having so much fun! Goodbye, Geodude! Thank you for playing. However, you have failed. Another Geodude. We'll just keep on going with Mudkip. Mudkip hasn't taken any damage, and we're doing really well because they're all rock type Pokemon, so we're good. Yay, level 14. Mudkip is the man. Thank you, youngster Josh, for getting in my way. Let's go fight the next youngster. Hello. If you can't beat me, you won't stand a chance against Roxanne. See, I don't think I'm gonna have a problem with Roxanne, little boy. I don't, I don't, I don't. I think Roxanne's gonna be a walk in the park. That's what I think, anyways. Water gun! Bam! Yeah! Awesome sauce. Alright, thank you. Please get out of my way, I enjoy free EXP though. Hello Roxanne, you look so derpy. Hello, I am Roxanne, the Rustboro Gym Leader. I became a gym leader so that I may apply what I learned at the Pokemon Trainer School in battle. So would you kindly demonstrate how you battle and with which Pokemon? I 
would love to. Because that means you're going to lose. <sighs> you're so totally going to lose. It's not even going to be funny. Holy crap, your Geodude's level 14. Water gun. Super effective. Yeah. It's a female Geodude. Is that even possible? I mean, I guess technically it bide. I don't know how I feel about bide. I mean, I guess I could endure his attack for two turns to retaliate double. Let's get rid of Growl, I guess. Ha ha ha! A nose pass. That's that thing that looks like a nose, right? Yeah. <laughs> it looks like a nose. Oh, it's using Harden. Are you trying to up your defenses? Do you think you're gonna survive this? I don't think so. Oh, you did survive it. That sucks. Rocks bro. Ow. I don't appreciate rocks being thrown at me. I really don't appreciate it. And you used a potion, of course. Aren't you cool? That's alright, I got water gun. It's super effective, man. It is super effective. I will win. I am determined to win. Come on, Mudkip, you can do it. Mudkip, I have faith. Oh, she used another potion. Why? Why do you keep using potions? That's so not cool. I'm gonna have to use a potion before this fight's over. It's ridiculous. Super effective. Come on. Water gun. I win. Yay, I got my first gym badge. Happy face. Yay, player defeated Roxanne. So I lost. It seems that I still have much more to learn. I understand. Pokemon League's rules state that trainers are to, given, are to be given this if they defeat a gym leader. Please accept the official Pokemon League stone badge. Yay. Lori received the stone badge. Thank you. I appreciate it. Yay! The stone badge heightens the attack power of your Pokemon. It also enables them to use the HM move cut outside of battle. Please take this with you as well. Obtain TM39. What is TM39? Rock Tomb. It not only inflicts damage by dropping rocks, it also lowers speed. If you use a TM, it instantly teaches the move to a Pokemon. Remember, a TM can only be used once, so think before you use it. Awesome! I wish I could run inside of buildings. That was not implemented in this generation, obviously, because I am not running. Ah! Get out! Out of the way! Oh, it's that guy! Wait, please! Don't take my goods! Uh, I will be right there to help you with your goods. I just need to heal real quick, so if you'll excuse me for just one moment. I got to... Got to go over here. <laughs> Gotta heal my Pokemon real quick. And then I need to put Poochyanna at the top of the party again. Because Poochyanna has got to be trained at some point in time. Woohoo, I got a Poochyanna! Pretty sure Poochyanna becomes a dark type, right? Or does it remain? Yeah, he's a dark type. I'm gonna help you get your goods, I promise. Where did you go? Wait, what's up here? Is there anything up here? Is there anything up here? Oh, that's Route 115. We don't want to go that way. Hello. Oh, it's you! You're the fantastic trainer who helped me in Petalburg Woods. Help me, I was robbed by Team Magma. I have to get the Devon goods back. If I don't, I'm gonna be in serious trouble. Ugh, where did this loser go? Where did he go? He's on Route 116 somewhere? Really? Gotta go get your goods back? Ugh, I don't want to get your goods back. Alright guys, unfortunately, that is all the time we have for this episode. If you guys would like to support me, and if you guys would like to see more of Pokemon Ruby version, be sure to show your support by leaving a like and a comment in the section below. Both of those things really do help me, and I really appreciate it. In the next episode, we're gonna get his Devon goods back for him. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> so until then, I'll see you guys soon. 